Some people with panic disorder are very, very prone to hyperventilation, some less. And hyperventilation is a very precise term. It means breathing so that you lose too much carbon dioxide. And some people with panic disorder are very prone to losing carbon dioxide. But it, just over breathing or having chaotic breathing, breathing that's not well regulated will always make anxiety and panic disorder worse. Quite a lot of research over many years showing that working with breathing and more recently some research done showing that if you raise carbon dioxide levels with your breathing techniques that you'll have less panic attacks and less symptoms of panic. Certainly working with the breath is a way of controlling symptoms in the short term mm -hmm. but also if you work with your breathing over the long term for months then panic symptoms can improve and panic attacks can come with less frequency.